kill Lisa and I? Oh, we can't tell Spinelli. We have to go tell Alexis right now. You can't tell anybody. No one can know what Matt did. Tell the judge that Matt killed Lisa. No, I won't do that to Matt. Oh, your, your devotion is admirable, but Matt is guilty. He should pay, not you. Look, Spinelli, I appreciate your concern, okay, but it's done. I've confessed I'm about to be sentenced, and I'm okay with that, so let's just let it go. You are facing years of incarceration, possibly a life sentence. Do you have any idea how soul-crushing that would be? I'm not going to let you sacrifice yourself, not for anybody. It's not up to you. I profoundly disagree. If you don't come forward, I will. No, you can't do that, Spinelli. Not after everything I've been through to protect Matt. For something he doesn't even remember. His memory notwithstanding, he committed a crime which resulted in the loss Look, of a life. he was drunk, Spinelli. Because of me. Because I was a terrible girlfriend. Okay, that is manifestly not true. He insisted on going on the cruise without you. I mean, he made a point of leaving you behind, strongly implying that you were not good enough for him. Exactly. Because he had to rebuild his ego because I trampled all over it. I think Matt has plenty of ego to spare. I made him feel like his research wasn't important. That's why he was guzzling champagne, because he of me. He chose to drink himself insensibly, and he has to be held accountable for his actions, even no, if he uh, was too drunk to think straight. Matt can't find out that he's the killer, Spinelli. Patrick and Emma, they need him now more than ever. They need you, too. As what? A constant reminder of the explosion? Robin would still be alive if it weren't for me, and Patrick knows it. You are throwing your life away. That is the last thing that Patrick, Robin, or anyone would want. <laughs> Matt's life means more than mine. That is not true at all. Your life is... He is a brilliant Dr. Spinelli. Okay, he can save countless lives if he's not in prison. And if you're in prison... Imagine all the world will lose. <laughs> Couple photo shoots. A well accessorized wardrobe, who cares? What about your family? What about me? You'll be better off when I'm not constantly taking advantage of you. My life will be irreparably harmed in your absence. I love you, Maxie. If you mean that, you'll take this secret with you to the grave. What's going on? Spinelli's just worried about me. I was uh, telling him that I'm at peace with my decision, and for once in my life, I know I'm doing the right thing. I, I don't doubt the nobility of your intentions, but I, I can't reconcile myself to your course of action. But you'll support me anyway, right? Because you know that I trust you, and this is what I need. Actually, I would do anything for you. But I, I just, I... Mom? Hello, baby. It's good to see you. Why are you here? I'm your mother, and I love you. Really? That's nice. Go away. Tell me Dad isn't with you. No. He's probably off doing something important. Why don't you join him? I understand you're angry. angry? You have every right. No, not really. You know, it turns out that nothing that you ever did even comes close to what I've done. It doesn't matter. I still love you. You will not believe Maxie's mom showed up. I fear she will only add to her daughter's pain. Robin's dead because of me. Did anyone tell you that? I don't believe that. Oh, please. So now you're trying to prove that you have faith in me this late in the game? Well, of course I have faith in you. I know you're you are. a terrible mother. And I'm a terrible daughter. So let's not pretend otherwise. This keeps getting worse and worse. What were you going to say before Felicia walked out? Ladies and gentlemen, court is now in session. Just leave. I'm not going anywhere. Let's go. The Honorable Judge Lopez presiding. Do you understand that by entering a guilty plea, you waived your right to trial? Yes, Your Honor. You pled guilty to two counts of murder. Are you prepared to receive sentence? I find myself in a peculiar position. My client has chosen against my advice to plead guilty. I do not believe that my client is guilty. 
And in all of these testimonials, you hear people tell you that she is creative and wonderful and intelligent and will make Ms. a great Davis, contribution. is your client reconsidering her plea? I'm afraid not, Your Honor. Well, then you leave me no choice. Ms. Jones, please rise. Mariah Maximiliana Jones, I hereby sentence- So wait, wait, wait! Your Honor, there's something you should know. 